started off as a nurse. I was in nursing school third year. Then my pictures got leaked. That's what came about. Like that's when I started doing nude photo shoots because um, it was tough. I mean, I didn't get the insults back then when my my photos, my nude photos came out. I got suspended from work. But people were actually calling and asking if they can buy my nude photos and stuff. And I was like, well, since I don't have a job again, I can just use this one to finish nursing school because I was in my third year. And then I don't know who leaked it. Up to now, I don't know who leaked it, but it was just a normal, like I used my phone. I sent it to someone I was dating back then and somebody else he was with sent it out. So I actually, I didn't even know about it. I got to work. Um, I was doing my clinicals by then and then I was asked to come to the office I was given a letter for indefinite suspension and then that was it so, no I mean I I didn't bother about it again because the money was coming it was way way better and I was like well forget it And I got comfortable with the money that was coming in and then I stuck to it and because I was getting contracts to do nude shoots I was getting paid and that's what started with the snapchat and the Instagram stuff but music has always been something that I wanted to do because I love singing it's not like it used to be in the beginning you no, know, the money was really good I, it was it was really good but CC idea I'm not actually active on Snapchat as I was before. Yeah, it's mostly on Instagram. And with the Instagram, I, when I do nude shoots, most of them I get paid to do nude shoots. Not all of them get to come on Instagram because they tend some outside the country. Like, I don't know what they're using it for. I mean, I'm just taking my money, so I'm not really bothered. I mean, I can go months without meeting anybody. It was my photos that were selling more than, yeah. I can go months without having to meet because most of them were foreigners, not Ghanaians. Yeah. Um, let me see, let me see. There was this ambassador and he gave me. Those times it was the first time. I think it was $700. I was shocked because it was actually for $400, but. The way we spoke, I had time for him, we were chatting and all that. Yeah, but that was it. I never saw him again. They tell me I'm genuine for once because most of the girls are guys in disguise on Snapchat. They don't pay. Like, you pay for something and then they block you. But I always make sure say you're satisfied with what you want. Yeah. If you, if, if, if you are, how do I put it? Yes, it can. Snapchat Premium can build your house. It can set you up. That is if you manage your finances as well. Because it's business. Business is business. And in every business, no. It depends on how you manage your finances. <laughs>